Morning, everybody. Kind of a late start this morning. Um, enjoying all the feedback that I'm getting off everyone for the vlog so far. Any feedback that you've got, stick it in the comments for us. Uh, I am reading all the comments uh, while I'm still deciding. I'm over halfway now. This this represents uh, day five, so well over halfway now. So, yeah, this is day five. We are two more days left of doing it for definite, um, Friday and Saturday. Nothing planned for Friday. Nothing planned for today, actually. Uh, and then Saturday, I'll be going watching the Rugby World Cup final. So, hmm. Squawker Dave. I've had an absolutely right shit day today. I've been so busy. Uh, I literally haven't had a chance to breathe. There's not been much in the vlog because I literally have just been sitting here working, editing, doing graphics, uh, all day. Um, went out with Jaden for lunch. Um, not in school because of the EU referendum thing, so that was like the only break that I've had and then I cooked tea later on. He's downstairs now watching um, Gladiator, he's never seen it top man film um, so I knew this point would come in doing the vlogs where there's just literally been fuck all happen fuck all at all happen um, I've been on Skype calls for work um, but let, let's, like there's been there's been no opportunity to do anything else during the day I haven't um, managed to get to the gym because Jay's been off um, and I haven't done anything I did plan on doing something in the garden um, doing the, the kettlebell session that's my go to if I manage to miss and it's now quarter past ten and I, you know, I've not even I've not even got anything sufficient for the video um, <laughs> literally is completely devoid of ideas I need to go and put a wash on if that's of interest to anybody um, So yeah, this this is the point in the vlog, day five, where I begin to think maybe weekly is the way. I feel under some um, self-imposed pressure to be able to deliver something every day. I thought about doing a QA. and a and I thought I don't really want to ask on Twitter for a QA. and a I like to keep the Q&A to the audience that's already watching and stuff like that. So maybe I should have done that yesterday. Maybe I should have preempted that I knew today was going to be shit. Um, and and add a Q and A um, and got it ready to roll with a Q and A. Um, so that's on me. Maybe that if I do do the the weekly planning ones, maybe that's something I introduce on a regular basis is the weekly Q and As. I haven't managed to stick to my upload schedule at all this week, apart from the daily vlogs. I um I have a pretty stacked out calendar. I use my iCal. Apple Calendar all the time. It is literally my go-to app. I'm always in there. If I need to go and meet someone for any reason whatsoever, there's anything that I need to do, it goes in the calendar or it don't fucking happen. Today, this one isn't loaded up. And that's going to take too long to come back on quickly, I think. Um, the weekly upload schedule that I created for myself for my YouTube channel involves somewhere along the lines of Mondays, try and get a championship or football manager video up. Now, that don't take me too long to do at all. Maybe 45 minutes or something like that of recording. And can you see how the calendar's bouncing? That's why that needs upgrading. Not down there. The calendar app, for fuck's sake. Um, oh, and I've made a decision on what I'm going to do with all the upgrading shit as well. I'll come to that in a sec. Um, so, the the calendar basically is Monday, get an upload done for Football Manager or Championship Manager. They don't take me long to do. What takes me long to do is the playing of the games in between. I've had no time to play games in between, so I can't release an update of them because they're all just at the save. Normally, what I do is when I finish an upload, I save it, and then I go and edit that upload. Uh, I don't carry on playing for another couple of hours. I've got a UFC save that I need to 
progress on and get uploaded. Uh, obviously, I think I showed you guys this the other day. This is my new backdrop for MMA Latest, which should be getting its debut today if you're watching this on Friday, which it should be. Uh, the weigh-ins will go out about 10 o'clock Friday night, uh, and this will be in front of this backdrop for the first time. So I'm pretty chuffed about that. I'm really dark, aren't I? That's because the light's all the way on the other side of the room there. Um, so yeah, the upgrades, as I was saying, for that, oh yeah, there's my calendar, so you can kind of see the calendar from there, I imagine now, if I focus it on there, there you go, so you can see all the greens matches, and then there's all the other shit that I've got to do, the blue is mostly my uh, upload, so transfer talk, uh, podcast, that went up alright, a q and I've got sort of slated for Friday, Sunday I have paper talk, so I, I have stuff planned to get um, to get done on the calendar, it just generally hasn't been getting done, unfortunately. So, uh, if I'm going to do the weekly vlog, and I, I specifically said I'm going to film it all on the iPhone, I can also use the GoPro because the GoPro can use Wi Fi to upload stuff to the iPhone, so that still counts. I don't want to have to go to the machines to edit anything to upload it, so you're probably not going to be seeing any fancy graphics or anything like that in these vlogs because the whole purpose of me being able to do these is that I can do them and upload them all on my phone that was like my little challenge to myself and so far that's what i've managed i've used a couple of clips from the gopro um to, in fact do i need to put that on charge because i am planning on doing some stuff with the gopro tomorrow but i'm going to take the dog for a walk wearing the gopro just because that's a, a different sort of look isn't it and the decision that i've made on upgrading all this shit is um and get some extra ram for the map uh, for the macbook i reckon that gives it another year in another year's time, hopefully I'll have some cash to be able to buy a new MacBook straight off. And I think in the interim, that's going to need replacing. And I think what I'll probably do is upgrade uh, or build a Hackintosh and uh, use a, a, an ordinary monitor. Unless I have a bit of spare cash and I can throw it at trying to make the one that's sat over there, the shell, into a working monitor. Which I do think would look cool. But you're know, looking at you know completely ball busting myself, spending even more money on it when I could just buy a nice monitor and just leave it as it is, couldn't I? But I do like the aesthetic of the Apple monitors and stuff like that. So that is basically that. It was a real shit day today, a really stressful day. Um, I've got to pay a fine tomorrow. Do you know what I thought speeding fines used to be? Sixty quid and three points. I should be fined three hundred and twenty-seven quid. Twenty-two pound of it is a is a victim surcharge. Who's the fucking victim? And no, I wasn't doing nothing crazy. Uh, where's my thing? I was doing thirty-nine in a thirty. Fucking happens, doesn't it? So um, I got to pay that tomorrow. I'm not fucking happy about that. I could rather not be paying that tomorrow. Um, hopefully tomorrow's going to be a better day <laughs> because today's been shit. Um, so this is day five, tomorrow is day six, and then Saturday, day seven, and then I'll make the decision on whether I continue with another one on Sunday for day eight. I do like doing them, I just don't know if it's too much. I think there might be a spot in the week that I can use for the vlog as a daily, as a once a week thing, but we will see. Anyway, thank you for tuning in. As always, your feedback is important. Um, today has been a shitter. Um, I would have liked to have done a Q&A. I think that would have been good. But I didn't plan ahead. <laughs> um, a couple of people have asked me my opinion on Ireland getting through to the groups. Uh, and Especially the, the victory over Italy. That was big. That was that was massive. And uh, I can't look at the, the fixtures for the second round because I saved it on there. Unless it can... Uh, I can get it on here. Because having looked at the, the two sides of the um, of the final knockout draw, England's got a horrific draw, haven't they? There's going to be a relative minnow in the final coming from the left-hand side of the draw, isn't it?
yeah, I saved a really good graphic on there, and obviously I can't uh, do it now. So second round draw, here we go, round of 16 draw. Uh, Switzerland, Poland, Croatia, Portugal, Wales, Northern Ireland. That's great for one of the home nations to definitely be in the quarterfinals. Hungary and Belgium, I think that'll be a good game. Uh, Croatia, Portugal, you've got to say the favourites are probably going to come from that game, but this tournament, it, it really could be anyone. Um... And I could see Wales getting all the way through there to the semi at least. In our side, in the English side of the draw, uh, Germany, Slovakia, pff, probably going to have to be Germany, isn't it? Italy and Spain, you could pick them at the moment, both very strong, both a nightmare. So you're looking at one of the um, one of the quarters being Germany versus Spain or Italy. That's huge. And then you're looking at England should get through Iceland. That's not being disrespectful to Iceland. They just should. Um... Spain versus, uh, sorry, France versus Republic of Ireland. I've got to pick France on there because I think they were my favourites going into the tournament. They're still my favourites, really. They've not clicked into gear yet, but I think they're well capable looking at their squad. So I expect that to be England versus France and probably Germany versus Italy, I reckon. Which means it's probably going to be a France versus Germany semi on this side and maybe... I think per Portugal versus Wales on the other side, which is uh, which is kind of mad that Wales have got so far. Um, but there you go. I think uh, it's interesting. Um, I can't wait for the games to start again. I was debating doing a transfer video tonight, Thursday night. I just can't be asked at the moment. Today has really just sapped all the energy out of me entirely. So um, tomorrow there'll be a daily vlog. This one be going up at 8 in the morning which I'm really liking being able to just schedule stuff out for 8 in the morning and not have to bother doing anything it just uploads while I'm doing nothing I think that's a great little feature um, and hopefully I think Saturdays will be pretty good I've got quite a lot to do on Saturday so hopefully Saturdays is going to be decent thank you for tuning in if you've watched all of them so far tell me what your favourite parts of them are uh, tell me what you don't like um, you know, I'm, I'm learning everything I do with this channel that I've got no, I did a betting preview one week. It fucking bombed. Didn't do it again. Um, I try stuff. If it works, great. I keep it. Like the Sunday pay per view seems to be really popular, and it's one of my favourite videos that I do every week. I'm glad that I got into the routine of making sure I do that every single week. I I want seven days worth of content, and sometimes there'll be, there'll be two videos a day. If I'm doing a daily vlog, and then I manage to throw out a, a championship manager one or something like that in the afternoon, and I can get two videos a day. Fucking great. I have no idea how I'm going to talk for enough enough for two videos every single day. But I'm aiming to have something every single day. That's why I wanted to do the daily vlog. I don't want to miss a day without uploading something. So, as I said, feedback's important. Tell me what you like, tell me what you don't like. Did you check out the podcast that we did yesterday with uh, Keith Webber? Um, it's getting some really good reactions from it. It's not had a great deal of listens, but it's had a great reaction from those who have listened to it. So... Have a listen to it and then go check the guy out. Give him a subscribe on YouTube as well because his channel's going to be awesome. I've just got a feeling. Anyway, thank you for watching. This is the end of um, day four. I haven't got anything clever in terms of like shooting or how I'm going to finish it off because I'm just fucked today. Um, so that's me. Out of here. See you in a bit.